Kia ora. I hope you're all doing well this beautiful morning. Um, I just wanted to give you a heads up on this week. This week is Tech Week, which means we have so many activities and we also have competitions lined up for you throughout the week doing online learning. Anyways, um, yeah, so I'll just give it to um, Ash Fleming because she'll talk to you about Tech Week and she'll give you all the good activities and then we'll also look at um, the heads of Academic Council and they'll also talk to you about different tips that you might need throughout online learning. Bye! G'day guys! The Tech Council are running two competitions this week in celebration of Tech Week. How fitting is it to be online, eh? Our first competition is the Minecraft competition. We would like you to build anything you want on Minecraft. It could be anything from your dream house to a fire-breathing dragon. Just get creative and send your designs through to us here at the Tech Council. We will judge our designs and the winners will be given content vouchers to be used when we are back at school. Our second competition this week, if Minecraft isn't your style, is your digital art competition. We would like you to draw and design on any online software such as Google Drawing, Paint, Adobe or anything else you fancy. Once again, send your designs and masterpieces through to us with the email linked below and on screen now. The winners of the digital art competition will also be awarded a canteen voucher to get to get drawing to be in to win. Make sure you hand them in by 11.59 on Friday. Hey guys, that's all from us, the Tech Council. We look forward to seeing what you come up with. Stay safe and we'll see you soon. Hi everyone, Academic Council. I'm hoping that you are doing well in your studies during lockdown. We just have a few tips to help you guys stay focused and stay on task. So first thing is to-do lists. Just like this, they are quite helpful. You just put them all down there and you can put wee check boxes and tick them off as you go. They are really helpful to make sure that you stay on task, you do everything that you need to do but make sure your lists are manageable. Second thing is setting yourself a quiet study space. As you can see, I'm in a way quiet study space. We've got my desk here. Being in a quiet space, like make sure there's no distractions like the TV, your parents, your siblings. It just helps you stay on task while you're doing the task. And third, ask for help when you need it. Your teachers are there to help you. You can ask them through emails, through Teams. I'm sure they will help you with any questions you have. They are there to help. We hope that you guys have a good time studying, hopefully, during the lockdown, and we'll see you soon. Hi, it's Emily. We just want to let you know that if you're struggling or finding it hard, then that's completely okay. Just make sure that you're talking to somebody about it. And don't forget to keep looking after yourself. Make sure that you're eating, you're exercising, you're sleeping. Remember, Avonside, we've all been here before, and I know that we can get through it again. Let's go. Bye.